Hello, and welcome. I'm Zinder, and here we are again in Dark Souls. Got myself back up here on Sense Fortress. As you can tell, that douchebag over there has respawned, but he's actually pretty pointless now. Um, on the other hand, I shot that guy up there to death with my bow. Which is why I now have... 20. 20 arrows left. Um, getting up here, obviously trying to get back onto Sen's Fortress, I ended up losing the souls that I had lost over here. Boo-hoo. Oh, that guy up on the top gave me 3,000 souls, by the way. But, uh, no major loss. Think... Oh, come on! I think what I'm gonna do is I'm going to buy more arrows. Since I'm here. Oh, I upgraded my longsword to 10, by the way. So, it is considerably better than that other thingy now. I'm... Well, uh, fuck it. It's not worth it. I'm going to buy... A lot. I'm going to buy another... Another number. I'm going to buy... I think I'm going to buy 80 again. Another smooth 4K. Brings us down to 8200. That guy up there, he took a lot because of the range I was. My arrows were doing 20. Ooh, ooh. Okay. Now, I want to jump across here. Where's the guy that was... Oh, there he is. Oh, I can't lock onto him from here. Oh, well. I want to know if I can make that jump. Oi! And so I did. Uh, where does it go? Oh, back down inside. Shit. Uh, ooh, where's this go? This goes to a little ledge. It's right here that takes me up here. Indeed. I don't have to worry about Sir Blasty, so my life is considerably easier than it could be. That's his official name, Sir Blasty. I'd, I'm guessing because of the fact he gave me 3,000 souls, he's not going to respawn. So I'm going to hopefully hope that he doesn't respawn. And even better, I don't want to deal with you, man. I already got the shit that was back there. I do believe we were somewhere that would take us somewhere. Somewhere over this direction when I was like, ah, fuck that, don't want to go there. However... That is no longer an issue. Because this narrow ledge no longer matters. Because the bomb guy no longer exists. Why can I not lock onto him? Oh, shit. Oh. Oh, fuck. I don't know what the default lock on button is. Uh. Yeah, I was playing with my mouse settings, and I don't know what the default lock-on button is. I decided to reset my mouse settings. Good fucking idea, me. Now, I want to... Right, weapon, action, attack, no, parry, no. I want lock-on. Lock-on is... Did I pass it? X. Can I change that to this button? No, I cannot. Can I change it to this button? No, I cannot. Okay. That's going to be a slight problem. Shit. I don't want to stop recording because I've actually had issues with DX Story no longer wanting to start back up. Yeah, okay, now I'm up here on this roof. That guy was. Is there any way I can just blow this up right now? Ooh. 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 See, I don't know if they're exploding, so I don't want anything to do with it. Ooh. 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 <laughs> Is 
there an item up here anywhere? Or did I just waste a bunch of arrows for nothing? Uh, no. No item. Ooh. I wonder... Oh, that is definitely way too fucking far for this thing. Yeah, I can't hit them. Uh, actually, they are hitting them as far as I can tell, but I'm guessing they designed it so I couldn't do that. Um. Hmm. Hmm. Oh. Oh. Uh, is there no bonfire anywhere near here? Seriously? Is this where I came from? No? No, it's not. There's also nothing here. Why is there no bonfire in this entire goddamn place? Ah, shit. I have figured out how to fairly... Should I say speed run my way up here? Okay. Let me lock on. Lock on. Lock on. Oh, god damn it. Lock on. Yeah, yeah, 21. Yeah, fuck this. Okay, he does a sweep that's not always followed up by the other sweep. Incoming. Oh! Oh, that hurts. That hurts. Don't try and block him if you can help it. Woo! Okay, punches the ground. This is a hell of an angle. Not very hard. Oh, oh, sounded like I got hurt there. Shit! Whoop! Come over this way. You're a little bit too close to that edge for my liking. Swinging at me. Roll. Shank, shank, shank. Um, um, I can run between his legs. Isn't that handy? What happens if I two-hand this? Ah, you prick. Oh. Oh, what? What? What just happened? Interesting. Very interesting. Very... I should show you guys my uh, super amazing, awesome... Oop, that's not what I meant to do. A super amazing, awesome speedrun method I've got going on for this. That's highly dangerous and completely unreasonable. Now, I don't know if there's any kind of a spirit I can get from wandering through this area or what. But... We shall see. Depending on how fast I get through here. If there is, it's probably not until up top. And you'd think there would have been a bonfire, but... I've actually got running through here pretty good in terms of speed. Those guys... Pendulums. 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 Run through. Lock my way through, just in case. Run past that pendulum. Run this way. Come up here. Oh, not being able to lock on is a large problem. Get through here. Kill him. Okay, maybe he's not dead, but I don't care. Yeah, X is a really weird button to hit for me. Run, 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 run. Run this way. Hit this trap. Run into this trap. Like a dumbass. Wait for a bowl to come running past. Run into the bowl like a dumbass. Come up here.
Okay. And I'm sure you see what I'm saying about getting through here pretty quick now. Uh, it's not normally this retarded, though. And... I don't know. I guess it works. Technically. Yes, I want to go this way. I go up here. I guess I don't even need to screw with the ball launcher because I don't see it again afterwards. I've been rotating it just in case lately, but I guess it's not even necessary. Oh! Oh! Ow! That's the first time I've been hit by those! Oh no, I feel mighty retarded. This thing, I've been really stupid at this. Until I realized that I can just do that. Um, I end up with a problem here. Oh, because... It aggroes the other guy down below. Actually, I have an idea. Now, oh! Now you see that thing? That little point there is saying, this is safe, but I failed. Son of a bitch! Ugh. Yeah! Okay. I'll be back with you when I get to the boss. Fuck, all those souls, I feel so bad. I seem to have encountered a problem. I fell down in the tar pit at the bottom. Somehow survived. Now I'm up here. No idea where the hell I'm going. Oh. Okay. Um, yeah. I've been in such a hurry that it's actually causing me many, many, many issues. Many, 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 many issues. Like, I should have been up top a long time ago, but I am hurrying so much that shit like that happens. It's just, I get sick of going through this place a million, billion, billion times. But, yeah, it's pretty much at the point where I'm going to look for a bonfire even harder up there. And I know that there is a sniper crossbow for a fact. We're definitely missing something. And I am going to find it. These guys, however, are still non-issue. But I need to make sure that guy over there at the end falls off so he doesn't fuck up my caster rushing. Okay, now that I've made it through, do this, and laugh at him. Tee hee! Look, I retrieved my zero souls. Oh, uh, oop. Oop. And run through here, kill him with this, don't do anything stupid. Problem solved. Run through. Here. He's asleep and doesn't care. This thing, for some reason, does not like to change. However, that caster likes to attack me. And as such, I'm gonna kill him because he's actually caused me grief a few times now. Oh, by the way, I should probably mention this. I was chilling out down by the blacksmith, and I used all of those soul items I had sitting around. Upgraded my short bow to plus five by buying Titanite from him. And I have also added points to Dex and Endurance. So I think it was one to Endurance and like three to Dex. I had like 50,000 souls after I did it. I'm not even kidding. Hey. Yo. You. Guy. the button. Uh. Note to self. Charge through. But anyhow, 
I'm gonna actually be more methodical and intelligent about this whole process, and then I'll get back to you. Alright, oh, we're back, we're up here, and uh, Sir Roof Douchebag is dead still. The the rock throwy douchebaggy guy. Hmm. How do you get down there? That's how you get there, but how do you get there? You couldn't possibly fall from here? The fuck? Um, I do wonder how much damage this will do to this guy. I don't think I'm going to stand here and shoot him for too long, but I want to see. Wow, that was actually rather impressive damage. Uh, I don't want to jump down there, because I don't want to die. Tunnel, that's what I came out of. The only place I can even see that you could get down there from is here. But jumping from here looks like a really bad idea. That is a lot of rocks. Just saying. A guy with what sounds like a crossbow is trying to shoot at me. Because he's retarded. Oh, uh, I don't think I mentioned this. I managed to fix my whole mouse lock on thingy. Meaning I actually went back into my mouse settings and fixed it. Giant fog door. I feel like I'm missing something. Particularly a bonfire. But, I could be wrong. What do you think this guy's weakness is? I think it's a little bit too late for that. Hey! Yo, you! You! Hey, you guy! Ow. I think he stepped on me a little bit. That was cutting it close. So, two-handing doesn't really seem to be doing anything for me. Oh, never mind. It does do considerably more damage. Never mind. I was wrong. I was wrong! I'm sorry. Whoa. 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 Um, back. Come over here. Shit. Ow. Oh. Hmm. Ow. Okay. So that's how he wants to play. Oh, the fuck? Um... What happened? I'm so confused! What did I do? Oh, he's standing back up. Whee! Oh! Oh god! Don't do it! Okay, I thought that was going to hurt considerably more than it did. Don't taunt the boss, you dumbass. Otherwise, boss will taunt your face. Ow.
Come over here, please. Thank you. Ah, I'll cut your knees off. Suck on that! Core of an iron golem. Humanity? This is a very orange circle. Not entirely sure what it's all about either. Uh oh. Hey! Hey! Who are you? What do you want? Why are you taking me? Where are you taking me? Why are you taking me? This is, uh, Anor Londo, by the way. In case you care. Not entirely sure why they're dropping me up here. <sighs> okay. Humanity. Oh, the humanity. Holy souls! Hey, wait, what's that saying? Tough enemy ahead. Great. Um... He does look tough, doesn't he? Enemy ahead. Ignore me, please. Okay. 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 Bye. I know there's a bonfire in this area. And I will come back and kill all of these guys. After I use it. This is one of the advantages of watching other Let's Plays, but doing it a while ago. You don't remember everything, but you remember the important things. Like this. I consider this to be extremely important. Hi. Well, welcome to the lost city of Anor Londo. Chosen undead. I'm chosen, if you huh? Seek Lord Gwyn's old key, Why do people tell me that? And head straight yonder. Hmm. If you are the chosen one, a revelation shall visit thee. Oh. What follows thereafter depends upon you. Oh. Reinforce Estus Flask. Nice. Hmm. What is it? What am I? Well, I am the keeper of the bonfire. If not for me, what beacon would there be in this lost city? A gatekeeper and a guide. That is my calling. Uh huh. The bonfires attended by the keepers are special. They are linked to one another, and their flames never die. Linked to one another? Yet never shall the keepers of these flames meet. Interesting. If you require rest, now is the time. That is, after all, what the bonfire is for. Fine, fine. Okay. Now, why can I not use this? Here we go. Oh, ten Estus flasks. So I'm assuming fires with keepers are automatically kindled. That's what it appears to be. Now, I want... Where do I keep gaining health from? Eh, whatever. I want to... Be really cool if I could convert a level into humanity. But, uh, I think... Take another point in dex. Another point in strength. And I'll be able to place one more point that I will put in... I really want to put it here. Because that'll help me block damage. I'd rather block than eat. If that makes sense. We're saved here. What does this say? Liar ahead. I don't see anything lying. All these walls appear to be true. What? Oh, okay. Now I know there's chests throughout this area as well. 
but uh, screw the chest. Actually, not screw the chest. I want the chest. Screw the big, tall, and uglies. Question is, how hard are the big, tall, and uglies? Okay. Oh. Oh. Uh, he hits really hard, that's for sure. How did that hit me? Hey! Stay where I want you to be. Well, that guy was pathetically easy. Oh, 1,500 souls for that. Really? In case you can't tell, I'm trying to pull one of these separate. My arrows actually do a fairly decent amount of damage now, too. Come out here. You know you wanna. Do they all use halberds? And why was that not as strong as I was expecting? Hey. Hey now. Ow! Ow! Okay. Well, there's one more guy in here who has a chest behind him. Hello? Hello? Hello, sir? Uh, yeah, your thrusty, stubby halberd attack won't work very well if I'm circling around you like a jackass. Oh. Yeah, your shield smashy thing won't work very well if I'm not in front of you. These guys are actually pathetically easy. I should have checked if that was a mimic. Demon Titanite. See, I still don't know what that is for. I'm assuming probably upgrading of some kind, but I don't really know other than that. Yeah, pretty much. There's two more of these guys over here. It said to go straight ahead, and I don't want to go straight ahead at the moment. I'm not done exploring everywhere else. But at least it did me the favor of saying, hey, to continue the story, go that way. Okay, that'll hit. Why fight two people when you don't have to fight two people? Ow. Thank you. I don't want to be directly under you anyhow. Oh. Oh. Ooh, I should have been blocking, but I wasn't, and it almost hit me. Dead? Dead. I never did look at the damage that's currently on the, uh, my longsword now. That's gonna hit. That's also apparently going to hit. Oh, hello. Nice of you to dodge there. One of those chests does not look like the other. Do you see that? Stop strafing right or left. Fuck. I keep strafing left, and it keeps allowing him to hit me with his halberd attack. So many souls. Oh, it's just the lighting. It's alive. Alive? No, it's not a living thing. Ooh, Twinkling Titanite. Oh! I was actually not expecting a mimic. But 
But hey, I'll fight one if you want to give me one. Why is it having such a hard time hitting me? What you drop? Give to me your item. Crystal Halberd. Ugh. Uh, Crystal Gear is bad. If you don't remember, that vendor outside Blight Town sold a crist sold Crystal Gear. The thing about Crystal Gear is you can't repair it. Although I'm not entirely sure how long a crystal weapon would last. They're incredibly powerful, but you, like I said, you cannot repair them. Uh, actually, I take that back. I think they get repaired from upgrading. Because it's called reinforcing and you reinforce them, but you can only do that roughly five times. Of course you can, you know, make crystal swords, or crystal weapons, when reinforcing. And you're dead, sir. Hmm. We'll save going the other direction for next time. We're not quite done here yet this time. I'm not done exploring. Oh, um... I remember this bit. We can't go through there. That door will not let you pass. I will show you this now. Sealed by the Great Lord's power. Which to my knowledge means we need a specific item from later in the game. Gorgeous view. Indeed. 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 Yeah. Uh, what a long run. I just want to go back to the bonfire. Go to the bonfire, use up these souls on another level, on... strength, maybe. Maybe Vit. No. Pfft, nobody uses Vit. Uh, let's see, endurance, or I could go with strength. This increases my damage by three. I'm going to go with that. Now, one thing I want to look at, because I never did it before, it's now 160 plus 79, which makes, that's 100 or 239 damage. That's getting very considerable. Now, I believe when it's at plus 15, it's 200, and then it has B scaling on both strength and dex. But it appears it still scales better on strength, because if you noticed, strength added damage to it. Three, or one more damage. Uh, three instead of two. I don't really need this flame ring at the moment, now do I? Hmm. Switch back to the blue tear stone ring. And I guess we have this. How much does a large soul of a proud knight give me? 3,000. Did we pick up any other souls while we were here? No, we did not. Uh, I am going to look to see what we get from the core of an iron golem. Um, see if there's anything I want from it. See if I get more from turning it into uh, King Seeper Framp. 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 Um. And. What? Plus five reinforced for weapons not reinforced normally. The fuck does that mean? Oh, and apparently Demon Titanite is used to reinforce. Um. Basically, soul based weapons. And that's to reinforce dragon weapons. Plus 14 reinforced standard weapon, plus 4 reinforced crystal slash lightning weapon. Yeah, because then we need a Titanite slab for the final level. Um, oh, and look, it was the hanging cage. But I didn't need it. For bars between New Londo and Drake Valley. 
Oh, the door that I had opened, I think. Yeah. Yeah, so... This key was pointless. This key was pointless. This one I needed. This one I needed. Uh, this one I don't know if I needed, but I probably did. Um, that one I think I did. This thing is amazing. Oh no, not that one. The other one. That one's amazing. That reminds me, we need to go back there, but we're not going to do that currently. Look at all these stupid things I have. Things I'll never be able to use. Partly because I don't have a pyramid's glove. But I suppose that's enough of talking about these random objects in my inventory. I will... See you guys... Next time. Goodbye.